Hi, it's Richard from Funfit Adventure, and we're here with the Hero Camper Ranger. And what we're going to have a look at is a little bit more detail on, on the kitchen, what comes with the kitchen, and what sort of setup you've got in, in the back here. So the Hero Ranger and the Hero Traveller are both the same in the kitchen. So let's open up and have a look. Just a very simple push in and lift mechanism. Two gas struts on either side, and I just push it up a little bit, you'll see it locks in place and then I can let that go. So different options that you've got in the in the kitchen here. The things that are actually accessories would be to add an awning onto the kitchen. So you see there's a bit of sail track that runs along the back of the roof here. And uh, if I just bring that back down, all you do is feed in that awning pull it along, pop it down here. It actually clips onto the um, stabilizers, some pulls at the, at the bottom. Open it back up again. And that would lift the awning up and the awning would come out to about, to about here. And there's two different options on the awning to bring it halfway down to the ground. And there's also an option to have a, a zip, which zips on the, the bottom piece that takes it right the way down to the ground as well to, to create a nice closing area at the back of the, the camper. So inside for, in the kitchen, um, you've got a stainless steel worktop on the top here with an integrated sink and a tap that runs off a 12 volt pump to the water tank, which is in this drawer. Now in terms of, in terms of cooking options, you've got a few options depending on, on how you camp. You know, you could, um, you've got two main sockets here, so you could actually use electric hobs. If you are always on a mains hookup, that could be an, an, an option. Or the other thing to do is to, is to have a, a gas stove on the top here, and you could get, you could have a double gas stove, or you could have a single one. A lot of people with the Heroes use the, um, the single, uh, the single gas burners with the disposable cartridges that you can sit on the top here, and you could maybe have one on, or you could have two on, depending on, on how you're cooking. The other option is, of course, to have a, a bigger gas bottle, feed the gas pipe up and have a, a burner on the top. So they're the sort of your options for uh, for different stoves on the top. And then there's a rail that runs along the back here, two different rails. Now, on here, you could hang uh, utensils. So you could just hang them straight off, off here, hang your tea towels off here, or you could hang little racks you could put your utensils in or little pockets that you can add things into the back here and of course leave them in in place when you set up your your kitchen um for when you go away on the side here there's a there's a light that lights up the kitchen the light's actually an led strip that runs along the, the top here which is quite nice because it's shining down on the workbench for when you're in the dark and, and preparing food so that is good you've got your 12 volt socket as well as your two Two main sockets there as well. In the drawers, pretty much the top drawer is a utensil utensil drawer. Plenty of space in there. You'll be able to fit all the utensils in there. A little bit bigger on the on the middle drawer, and then a larger drawer at the bottom, which uh, which would be quite quite good to put your pots and pans in. The um, the middle drawer has your 18 liter water container. And the pipe here runs up to the up to the tap here, and pumps out the water with the 12 volt 12 volt pump. And in the back, there's two compartments in the back here, uh, quite deep compartments. So if you've got something a bit taller, a bit bigger, it could be um, could be a gas bottle, and um, that could be placed in the in the back here. Or you could even have additional additional water storage if you if you needed that as well. The, the sink drains, there's a little little plug that comes with the Hero, and um, the sink just drains down to a, a pipe that comes out the bottom of the trailer. You put a bucket underneath, and then once that's full, empty it, empty it away. Quite a, a simple but effective system. And then in the drawer here, you can see this has got the uh, a little frost symbol on, and, um, and this is typically where you put your electric cool box or fridge inside inside this drawer and behind the drawer 
is a mains and 12 volt power supply. So you can either run off the battery system or if you're on a hookup, then your fridge can be running off the off the mains as well. And the, the, the fridge, you can add a, a fridge as, a, as an option from um, from ourselves. And um, or there's, there's other options that you can buy and, and fit into this space as well. So that's the kitchen. Thanks for watching.